I live in Ames with chickens, cats, apple trees, garden plots, and prairie plants. I don't watch TV, have no car, get around town on bicycle, organize Iowa meals, and own 500 acres of land in Pocahontas County. My family was privileged, but although I wanted to be a farmer like Grandpa with his horses and Dad, who was an Iowa State graduate and mechanical genius, farming was a man's world. The only place in it for a woman was to be a farmer's wife. I was uncomfortable and yet I chuckled when I read the caption under my photo in the high school yearbook. I grieve the limited roles for women. I grieve the many decades when I felt exiled from farming, but in retrospect, I appreciate how my life has come together like a quilt, a quilt made of fabric from several sources. Even so, I grieve the end of an era. Grieve corporate control of government and the Agricultural College. Grieve the mantras that say American farmers need to feed the world and that bigger is better. Grieve what is happening to the environment. Practical Farmers of Iowa is like family, and you have helped me find a role in agriculture. You are my heroes, and I admire how you walk the talk. Land is a limited resource, and people who own it are in a unique position to make a difference. Although my efforts seem small, it is a privilege to walk with you. Thanks for all that you do.